Do you remember backseat of BMW 6 speed too fast? No such thing, I can never slow down. I can never slow down. Would probably sound and be a lot cooler than having a shotgun mic and cars fucking riding around. Like, what? <laughs> what you say? What are they selling? Chocolate! Yeah, I always hated it. So what you setting up here? What is that? What you setting up here? The new DJI Mic 2s. Ooh. We'll test out my first time doing IRL testing of the audio. We'll see how it goes. Keep going. Keep going. What are you out here doing? Out here shooting pigeons. So we are walking around Tempe right now, me and Isaac. It is Super Bowl Sunday and everybody is hidden away in bars and all that watching the Super Bowl. So we're walking around trying to get some photos in the city while well, it's a little bit less crowded than what it normally is, but trying to capture on focusing on textures on buildings, just kind of getting out and shooting for fun, seeing like what we can find, see if we can get any banger shots. So let's uh, see where this vlog takes us and if we get any dope shots from it. It's all right with you, it's all right with me. No, I fuck up sometimes. If it's all right with you, it's all right with me. Crazy, hurt my neck. <laughs> So one of the best pickups that I made recently was this PNY Tech. It's called like a beetle clip. Basically allows you to snap your camera in and be hands-free. So when you're going around taking shots, super quick, super simple. Just pull your camera out, shoot, put it back in. It's definitely come in clutch right now with a lot of the stuff that we're doing, going around trying to get quick photos. And we are on bird scooters earlier, so kind of making sure your camera's safe but still moving around quickly, it's pretty convenient. But we're going to shoot this building back here it's got a lot of texture on it. The way the light hitting it looks really good. So I'll show you what these photos come out like. All right, so basically with what we're trying to do here is for myself personally, I get not wrapped up per se, but I have a lot of stuff that happens where, you know, I'm back to back shoots, different things like that. So I don't get a lot of time to end up shooting for fun. And this is something that I'm trying to do. One, Isaac's still learning a lot with how to use cameras. He's having a really good time with it. And for me is like getting that joy and coming out and just taking photos for fun. Even if all of these photos end up turning out like absolute dog shit, at the end of the day, I came out, I had fun, I walked around, saw different things, tried different things, and that's absolutely, or that's what counts the most for me, is so that I can keep all of that, you know, excitement and passion into this because that's what originally got me into this. You know, it was passion for a hobby, and I loved it, and I turned it into a career. So being able to keep that fun aspect is the biggest thing that matters to me. So that's pretty much what we're doing is, you know, trying new shit, and who knows? Maybe some of these photos turn out as bangers and then I'm super happy about it. You know me? Right? One step back, small step, right there. Because of the way the light is hitting the leaves on your face. Straight now, you can find me on the I 26 West Brown. Cause we got a good thing going. I will get you, but you know I'm into you. Yes, you ain't that bullshit. I don't know what the name of this effect is, but it looks pretty fucking cool. So I just put my shutter at one over four, so it's really slow. And then as I snap it, I drag the camera. It's probably a name for it. I don't know the technicalities behind it, but it looks pretty dope when you do it right. So now we are going, oh, also I picked up these uh, Freewell magnetic VNDs. So obviously it's dark right now, but super easy. 
just pop it on, pop it off. I got an extra glow mist filter on it as well, even though I keep my Cinebloom on this one at all times because the Cinebloom is pretty clutch. But we're heading back because ultimately Golden Hour is pretty much done. As you can see, there's still Golden Hour way down there, but there's really nothing cool to shoot down there realistically. So we are going to possibly go get food right now or we we'll text Huey first. We're supposed to go over to his apartment, work in like his little community center downstairs. Uh, they got a pretty dope setup, so we'll go there, get some editing done, get some food, eat, and then we will turn out and you know, see kind of how this vlog wraps up. I haven't done a vlog on YouTube in a very long time, and so trying to get back into it now, trying to be more consistent with all of my content and just record. I'm not home, so I don't have my office set up. I don't have my normal set up at all. So if I can get out and kind of make content while I'm here and kind of get the wheels going and churn and have video ideas so when I do get home, I can crank them out. That's ultimately the goal. So hopefully the vlog at least has had some type of entertainment. We'll see, but let's see where we're gonna eat. Sometimes, but if it's alright with you, then it's alright with me.